here virtually. And I would like to call on stage. Oh, he's already here. Alexander Kravinkel. Hello. Hi. Yeah, You're in right, Cologne, uh, right? Yeah. Thanks for having me. But first of all, yeah, sorry for not being there in uh, person. Unfortunately, I'm sick. Um, and I guess these days no one is happy if I'm there like coughing all the time, like with all the Corona, I guess it doesn't really make sense. So that's why I'm uh, here at home. Yeah. Sorry for that. But Alex, um, yeah, fortunately for me, I you... don't have Corona now, but I had it last year already. Um, but like we are dealing a lot right now with people who suffered from Corona, especially from afterwards, like from long COVID, because we are helping people suffering from fatigue and fatigue is a clinically relevant, massive form of exhaustion. Meaning for patients that small activities like taking a shower, playing with your kids or going for a walk can be so exhausting that patients need to recover for hours or sometimes even days. So you might ask yourself now, is this like a big thing? Is it like relevant at all? And unfortunately, I would say yes, because we see that just alone 90% of the MS and cancer patients suffer from fatigue. But we also know it from other chronic conditions, such as long COVID, rheuma, diabetes, and many, many others. Just alone in Germany, we have 4 million people suffering from it. Within the European Union, it's 30 million people. But also the economical impact regarding the costs and loss of profit for insurance and pharma companies is really big. That's why we are building the following solution. We are building an app that is collecting various vital and environment parameters that we are collecting by the sensors of a smartphone and variables. In addition to that, we have integrated several scientifically proven tests and questionnaires, which are like the clinical gold standard right now, and which we just digitized because usually it's tests that were used with pen and paper in clinics or hospitals. In addition to that, we have integrated a course that is helping patients with many regards in like physical activity training, nutrition, mindfulness, yoga, but also how to behave with friends and family or with your health insurance provider. Our app is already a medical device, is tested in several clinical trials, and we are able to show that we can reduce the level of fatigue and also improve the quality of life of patients. So how do we make money out of that? Right now, we are closing a couple of selective contracts with some major German health insurance providers that are insuring more than 20 million people here in Germany. And this is mostly like for our long COVID and cancer solution. And for our MS solution, we are right now to become a DIGA. We will handle in our application by end of the year. So there will be a DIGA for MS by next year. In addition to that, we are also working on a B2B white label SDK solution, having some first pilot partners like a health insurance provider, but also a major pharmaceutical company in the regards of MS medication. We're having a very interdisciplinary strong team, like Matthias being a medical doctor responsible for all the product development from medical perspective, Jana with her background in, uh, with her PhD in statistics, being responsible for our data science, but also the clinical trials, Benedict and Dominic with their backgrounds as uh, IT developer and engineer being responsible for the product development and me doing the business development. We are working together with some of the leading universities and clinics and having like a strong scientific advisory board, but also working like with some major corporates and companies. Yeah, currently, if you want to help us like building this company, we are currently in the fundraising mode. We are looking for 1.1 million of which 500K is already closed. So if you are working like for a VC or a family office, feel free to come to us. But in addition to that, we are also looking for other health insurance providers. So please also feel free to talk to us. And thanks a lot for your attention and enjoy the rest of the day. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot.